Hello and welcome. In this video I want to show you the clipper. The clipper is a tool where you can cut brushes. To activate the clipper press X. Now select a location where you want to have the first cutting point. I'm placing it here and here. In the editor I can see what that would do to the brush. I now hold Shift and press Enter. This allows me to keep both brushes. If you just press Enter, one of these brushes will go away. Then I deselect the brushes and select the lower one, go on Textures, Forever, and load the Dallas Mission Textures. I bring up the Textures window by pressing T. Now I want to have a different texture placed here. I'm gonna select um, this one. Only use the textures with great text on the outside. The others could have special properties like transparency and this is not allowed on the outside of the level. Good. The same I can do with this wall or with the floor. So let's do it with the floor. Have something special where this weapon is located. I'm gonna select this brush with Ctrl and Shift. Then I zoom in. Then I activate the clipper by pressing X. Select my location. I want the clipper to set cutting points. Press Shift and Enter. And I repeat this procedure in a different location. X, set two points, press Shift and Enter. And again, search for a location, press X, set two points. Shift and Enter, and the same here, X, two locations, Shift and Enter. Now I have a few brushes that are created when I clip this brush. I select this brush to apply a different texture to it. Pressing T again to activate the textures window, selecting a texture I want, now I'm thinking, hmm, that doesn't look as I expected it. Let's use the Fit button. I'm pressing on Fit to have this texture applied and fit it to this brush. The clipper allows you to place three locations for cutting. I, however, prefer to use only two because three-dimensional cutting is very tricky to handle and it can yield great results, but I find myself often to waste a lot of time to get it to work. So maybe you try it out, maybe not. You just have to set a third cutting location and then press Shift and Enter. I hope you learned something. See you next time.